Yeah, that was so much fun. Oh, <laughs> that's awesome. Oh, eat my asshole. This dude's gonna get up too. Okay, I actually have to look at this up because this game would pull some shit on me. Resident Evil Zero Green Red. Okay. Okay. Yes, okay. I'm looking stuff up because this game is pulling shit on me and it's actually making me angry. Okay. I mean, you've been seeing the shit that's happening inside, so like. I want to read that document. God damn it. Why won't... <clears throat> Leech growth records, February 3rd, 1978. Administered tea into four leeches. Their will to survive leads them to first parasitism and predation. predation? They, they, then they breed and multiply. Such a single-minded biology makes them attractive candidates for bioweapons research after no major changes observed. February 10th, 1978. Seven days since administration of tea, rapid growth to double size, double former size, signs of transformation emerging, spawning successful. They double their numbers in one hour, put, but their ravenous appetites lead them to cannibalism. Hasten to increase food supply, but lost too. March 7th, 1978. Provided them with live feed, but lost half when the live food fought back. However, the leeches are learning from experience and are beginning to exhibit group attack behavior. They also ceasing they are also ceasing cannibalism. Their evolution is, is exceeding expectations. April twenty second, nineteen seventy eight. The leeches no longer exhibit individual behavior even when not feeding. They move as a collective. They consume everything I offer with remarkable efficiency. April thirtieth, nineteen seventy eight. An employee has stumbled onto my experiments. Can a human be food be a, be a food source. How will the leeches respond? June 3rd, 1978. A day worthy of uh, commemoration. Today, they began to mimic me. Surely, they recognize their father. Wonderful children. No one will take you away. Nothing wrong with that. Nope. Not at all. The only good thing with, like, how they did this inventory shit in this game is they let you drop shit on the ground. I don't know. OK, 
Okay, there's so there's two doors in here. We came from this one. Let's see what's over here. Ah. Talk about bad camera angles also. I have like no room. giving me more health on accident investigators report dr marcus co-founder with president spencer of the umbrella corporation disappeared 20 years ago the results of his research have been kept under wraps the entire time the reason became clearly clear here at the training facility run by dr marcus well not here exactly but underground when we ventured below we understood there we found the evidence of Dr. Marcus's research into the T-virus prototype called Progenitor. The evidence of years of hideous experimentation that used company employees as guinea pigs. We cannot know how many were forced to become subject, but based on the evidence, no less than 20 individuals were involved. Some of them were taken deliberately to keep the corporation's secret safe. Where the doctor is now, I don't know, but considering the recent rapid growth of Umbrella Corporation, I can't help but think that this research is continuing. Yes, his experiment, his experiment lives and continues to grow in the dark. Those things, the fruit of his research, they fill the facility. The rest of the notebook are missing. Pa notebook pages are missing. I mean, it's a Resident Evil game. It's just always. Well, well, hmm. Save, 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 save. Oh, I wasn't trying to save yet. I think I might have to pass that. Pass the, um, the leech down. But I saved because there is a health pack up there, so like I need to send that down. God, I hate that fucking music. Lovely. Hey. Yep. Okay, I was right. God damn it. Get off of me, fuckface! Okay, so we gotta send the first aid kit down. And the slug down. So 
So we need the slug. And... Now we're going to take... We're going to get her, get this first aid kit. Send that down. In the shotgun shells. Why can't I send more than one thing down at a time? And they really pushed this whole mechanic where you have to do all these two person puzzles, right? Okay. Okay, we're going to take that. And then send the shotgun shells down. And we will... Let, let Billy wander around to the other section. Cheerio, mate. Okay. So, luckily, we should be able to take one hit and not die. So, we don't want to waste any health. God damn it. Hey, I mean, I saved it not too long ago. God damn it. Resident Evil Zero. This game can eat my butthole. Yeah. Well, the thing is, too, this time I figured out. I went into that hall. Oh, what the fuck? I didn't mean to do that. So I have more health than last time because I didn't get hit by him 
the first time. God damn it. Oh, I still have the save thing in my... Like, I don't think it's ever worth fighting that thing again. If I would have, I mean, I kind of realized I was fucked when it came to the, um, the, the corner I was in, or I would have used the health, pack, the first aid spray last time. How are these two communicating? <laughs> like, I don't understand. Is my camera like, okay. So it's also dumb because they have the red and green herb down there and Billy can't mix them. Okay. Let's see what happens. Always the best way to play games like this. Always see what ha uh, let's see what happens. Here you go. There we go. There's something written on the back of this the photograph to James to commemorate your graduation, 1939 a long time ago oh no judging from the age that guy could be marcus's son or grandson you really needed a cinema to say that what cable car moot <laughs> So, I don't know what cable car they're talking about. I don't remember seeing a cable car. Are you fucking... There's the other slug. Fuck your head. A 
Okay. So. <clears throat> what I'm really wondering at this point is... So... God damn it. Okay, we have pistol ammo in here. Remember. Remember! Remember! Is there anything else in this room? Okay, so now we send this back upstairs. Ugh. Get off me, fuckface! That should put me in danger, though. Maybe not. Because I took two last time. Didn't put me in danger, so I'm not using that fucking first aid thing. How do they know they're like sending shit to each other? Like, how do you know that I'm like going, yeah, I'm gonna send something to you now? This psychic bond they apparently have. The lock has been released. Eat a bag of dicks, Karen. Sterilizing agent. Oh, okay. So we need that for the other room, yeah. I get everything in here. A bunch of pistol ammo helps a lot because she's got the good pistol. Okay, that was in here. So that gets us in this room. This zombie on the floor here is actually going to drive me crazy. Yes. 
reading room key? Your head went boom. Um, where the fuck is the breeding room? Somewhere up here. The slug man is out in this hallway, isn't he? Because there's multiple of them. Multiple of them. Okay. That makes me feel significantly better that that was there. I mean, I want to dark matter, but I don't know. I don't know. This game is actually kind of aggravating. What the fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? All I have is a pistol. Oh my God. Oh my fucking god, is there two of Are you fucking kidding me? Holy fuck. Ow. Are you fu Oh my- me to fight this stuff Zero. how 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 now i have to do all the things oh my god oh my god God damn it, Rachel. God damn it. Your shit is not going to help right now. Have a good one, Pug. I at least know better what I'm doing right now, but my Okay, so we need that. So I think at this point we have to go with running past this thing. Because it's way easier that time. <laughs> 